All right, we're having a look at the ski erg today in the OPEX video of the week. Why not? Uh, Chris is going to jump on the ski erg. He's going to set himself up. He's roughly arm's distance from the ski erg. Let's not overcomplicate it. Here-ish will do. As he plays it, I get more and more used to it. He's going to grab hold of the handles. And then really simply, he takes them from this nice and tall position, pulls them down to roughly mid-thigh area. Boom. Rinse and repeat. Gets tall, throws it down. And relax. It really doesn't matter if you want to recover your arms out to the side or up through the middle, whatever's comfortable for you. Go back on for me, Chris. At the top, Chris is going to get nice and tall, right? He's going to pop that hip open. If he happens to float onto his toes, cool. If he doesn't, also not an issue. But what we don't want to do is have a little calf raise, just artificially open and then whoop, and then pull, all right? If you float onto your toes, that's fine. If you're artificially calf raising and falling over as a result, Less fine, all right? Grab the handles, throw them into to mid thigh level. That's about all there is to it. One last thing, it's never a squat. Can you do a squatty, squatty ski for me? This is, go lower, go on. This is not efficient. This is, this is just work to not get an aerobic response because he's just having to do squats and grab them, throw them to mid thigh. 